The Nigeria Super Eagles are preparing ahead of the double header against Guinea-Bissau. The first leg is scheduled to take place on Friday, March 24, 2023, as players training camp ahead of the 2023 African Cup of Nations, AFCON in Abuja. The Super Eagles, who are at the top of Group A with six points, will be playing against second place Guinea-Bissau to stand a chance of qualifying for the upcoming African Cup of Nations. This will be the first game for the Nigeria Super Eagles since they lost against Ghana on the 29th of March in the 2022 World Cup qualifying game, which left many Nigerians in a devastating mood. In an exclusive interview on Wednesday, the Super Eagles coach, Ose Pesaro, ahead of the Friday game against Guinea-Bissau, affirmed his team's readiness, stating the players are in high spirits. He added that the Super Eagles players are set up as a team in an attacking manner. Our team the must spread. attack. Our team must attack a bit. I think it's... If you want to reach the top in Africa, you need to you need to, you need to try, you need to do the control and the, the control and dominate the game. Okay, it's impossible to do in 90 minutes that, but step by step, you want to do it because if you want to to reach the top, you cannot uh, create one uh, one uh, one idea for the defender in the back and go in counter attack. I think this cannot happen. Speaking further, the Super Eagles Gaffer says he selected top teams for friend lies to prepare the Eagles all around for the main qualifier. For me, friend match is friend match. Okay. If I want to win the friend match, I choose, we choose other teams. For fans, it will be good. Okay? Or should better. Why? Because you play one. No big team, you beat them, everybody is happy. Sure. But I think you can improve more if you play against big teams than against other teams. For that, you play against Ecuador, Mexico, Portugal, and Algeria. Sure. You think are big weak teams, these teams? Yeah. Are weak teams? Yeah. Ask you. I ask you. What? I ask you. They are weak teams. No, these no, teams? no. They're, okay. they're pretty strong. The sensational and informed Nigerian forward for Napoli, Victor Osemen, and other players also speak on what Nigerians should expect from the qualifying game against Guinea. And I'm really happy to be here. Uh, I've been thinking about this game since the very last game I played for my. And this game is, is really, really important, most important in, in, uh, in Super Eagles at the moment. And um, we want to win this game. But of course, we have a huge respect for our, for our, team, uh, for our opponent. And then uh, the squad has been really working so hard. We have been studying them, although we, know, we don't know anyone among them. But of course, but we have a good squad because they are second in the, in the, in the ranking. And then uh, I think uh, for me, I, I think we have a huge chance to, to get the win on, uh, on Friday. But we won't be able to do this without working so hard on the pitch and giving our all. And I think uh, the squad is ready. Um, we're very confident because we have very good players. So I'm not going to promise anything, but I know that the players will give 100% to try and win this game. And we'll do our best with what we're preparing to make sure that we do everything we can. So we're going to the game feeling confident. So. I trust my players and trust our team, trust Nigeria that we're able to get a result. The Super Eagles coach also said that one of the top priorities of his employment is winning the AFCON. But in order to achieve that, Nigeria must first qualify. I beat three times. I signed for that. I work for that. But now, you need to beat Guinea. Is that if you lose the focus for the present, you can lose the future. You understand? If I lose the focus for the present, you can lose the future. The maximum focus in present for win the future. Okay? Thank you again.